available to any and all of his victims. And you have Mr. Two Days, Chris Miller, who's had his fair share of issues here at Fusion Wrestling. And they're going toe to toe right away. They're not waiting for one split second. The Archangel firing back with right hands. Look at Chris Miller. Chris Miller now. Now he's trying to get the better of the Archangel. The reversal by the Archangel as he sends him to the ropes. Miller ducks the clothesline, ducks the back elbow. The cross body press. He's got the Archangel down. The Archangel too strong, too early in this match to take the fall. Here's the pickup by Miller and a body slam. As Miller's on the run, he's trying to end this early. The two days leg drop. He dropped it guillotine style. The Archangels had no answer for this quick offense by Chris Miller so far. And he has taken this ring and he has made it his as the Archangel has had a very difficult time trying to fight back. Into each and every one of the four corners. And Chris Miller almost introduced the Archangel to each and every one of the four corners of the ring until that thrust. What a big boot by this man. The Archangel nearly knocked his head off. Slowly bringing him back to his feet. Chris Miller's got to avoid the hellbound choke slam driver. My goodness, Chris Miller got tossed over the top rope into the floor. And now the Reverend, the Reverend's on the floor. What's he doing down there? He's trying to abuse this man, Mr. Two Days, on the floor. Now the Archangel is going to stalk him on the floor. Again, a thrust to the neck and the throat. And Two Days, Chris Miller has had no answers for this so far. Another right hand. You're talking about a man that spits holy water into the fans' faces and then wants to punish his opponents ten times more. Oh, he tried to slam his head up against the side of the ring, but look at that. Miller got the better end of that and reversed it. Now he's got shots all over the place. Archangel's being lit up all over the ringside area. The fans are digging it, that's for sure. Here's a pickup, drop the throat first along that steel barricade. That is a hard surface to take any sort of abuse on. Miller brings Archangel back into the ring. Miller has had his issues in the past with the regime, but now he is in a fusion wrestling ring by himself. Look at how he ducks to get that close line attempt, and then the spinning back elbow. When the elements of nature cannot sustain the earth, where it has reached the environmental carrying capacity, there is one entity, there is one enemy that descends onto this planet from the third sky in order to correct the wrongs that were dictated through the demon, and especially those that were humans. This man's not human. And the archangel, the most scariest part about it is, he now walks among us. And he wants to make sure that every human being suffers torture at his hands. And the Reverend Devious only continues to preach the negativity. Archangel now measuring two days Chris Miller, but can't seem to knock him off of his feet. He missed with that roundhouse. There's a belly to back suplex attempt. He got his shoulders down for a moment. Look at that, he drops him again. Miller holds on. What strength by this young man. Three in a row. It, their shoulders are both down, but Miller's left shoulder was off the canvas. Archangel was the one who had the most opportunity to lose that one. And a flying forearm right to the head was on target, on time. That might have knocked Miller for a loop for a moment there. We've got this man, Mr. Two Days, Chris Miller who's in the process of being body slammed in the ring. Spinning elbow drop. Almost reminiscent of a great Muda-like elbow drop with the spin. Move reminiscent of a Japanese legend. And the Archangel getting a little frustrated, getting a little winded here as he's having a hard time trying to finish the job that he started. You got Chris Miller trying to score a victory in a decisive manner through good old-fashioned hard work and blue collar values. It can be done, but he has to be careful. He's in the ring with the Archangel. And the Archangel 
is one demented, sick individual who would like to prey upon his victims by leaving them in a trail of their own blood, sweat and tears. Mostly sweat and tears, but occasionally he doesn't care about making his opponents bleed. He has no compassion at all. Runs it to the corner, but he missed. Miller now sends Archangel's head into the top turnbuckle pad. Flying clothesline! Miller with his leg strength first in all close ropes. Running clothesline, another one. Miller has the momentum on his side. He missed with the roundhouse. He tried to kick him there. That heel kick. He got the Archangel down. I have never seen that sort of agility exercise by Miller before, but that's not going to be enough in this situation. There's circumstantial evidence here that supports the fact that Mr. Two Days Chris Miller has a chance of winning might be negated by the fact that the Archangel is still getting up to his feet, and he gets up to his feet with ease and quickness. But Reverend Devious is noticing that the Archangel has slowed down. Oh my, spinning, twisting drop right onto his back. His lower back and shoulders were exposed, and the Archangel was very disappointed that he could not get the victory off of that single drop. And now the Archangel searches and pursues other victims other than the one that he's supposed to be competing against. Wait a second. He grabs hold of that left ankle. He's turning the ankle now. An ankle lock has been applied. The Archangel trying to block out the pain. He does not want to get this one up so easily. Wait a second. Miller ran out of control. It was released. And then the hellbound, he just dropped him on his face. Oh, he picked him up. The Archangel's not done with him yet. Could he want to deliver another one? If he delivers another hellbound slam, I don't think this man will ever wrestle again. He already hit him with his finishing move. Wait a minute, Miller breaks the second attempt. Here's a pickup. Look at that. It got, the, it got reversed and blocked and countered. Look at that. He smashed his kneecap into the skull, the Archangel! He got the win! Wrestling fans, here is your winner, Mr. Two Days, Chris Miller! What a difference a day makes in Fusion Wrestling. Mr. Two Days, Chris Miller, has put down the Archangel, and now we anxiously await to see how the Archangel will respond. I set up! And he is not taking his eyes off of Miller at all. Can anyone hurt this man, the Archangel? And better yet, can anyone stop them for good? Chris Miller tonight was on a mission. He was on a mission to prove himself. And if Fusion Wrestling was